Oh my goodness. Hey everybody, it is me, Howard, Howard Reese, and I am so happy to be back here again. Finally, it has been months since I got sick in October to so many things happening to finally February 1st, I am back here on YouTube and I am so happy to be here. It's been long overdue, okay? Later in the week, we'll talk about my whole hiatus from YouTube and everything that was going on. I don't know if you saw, but I was on the Wendy Williams show. I mean, you could have missed it, but you probably was blind if you did. But if you look back, I was on the episode uh, with Ice Cube talking about Ride Along 2. So a while before, I submitted for tickets and out of nowhere, I got the email saying that I was accepted. I was like, oh. I'm gonna be at Wendy. Ah! I'm gonna get my Hot Topics in person, okay? <sighs> so anyway, I hop out of the truck to go stand in line. Um, did you know they have a dress code, okay? So make sure you sort yourself right on through, okay? You can't just go up in there looking a hot mess. I had a ch couple changes of clothes. I had more sequins in my bag because I was like, oh, well, if they don't like this, honey, then this is what I wore. And I had on my jacket, but it's too hot for me to be wearing that jacket in here. I said, if they don't like this, I'll just change into another sequin I brought. Okay, we can piece it together. We'll make sure it's cute for you. Because I said, this can be so much. But these are, I, this is not a costume. This is not any type of anything. This is just me, Howard Reese. This is just how I dress. This is just how I am. I love it. So I'm standing outside and it's cold as hell. Okay, I couldn't wear thermals up top because my thermal shirt is higher than this shirt so it just wasn't gonna work so i was just gonna be cold right and i said okay it's cold in the studio but you don't know how cold but we'll get to that i thought that i got there early enough to be first in line okay because i said i need me a front row seat okay i'm trying to get these hot topics quick ready and off the press <sighs> not so much so anyway they finally 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 opened the door which seemed like forever because i was freezing but they did say to dress warm but i said well i might just act like i didn't see that because i'm not covering or altering this First, as soon as you walk through there, you're going to go down the little hill, okay, and you're getting checked by security, okay? It is not a game. There is security everywhere, okay? Wendy is not running no nothing foolery. Let me tell you, you will not get away with a thing in there. They are coming to get you. They are on the red team, okay? Listen, I was like, oh, let me run up there and try to hug Wendy or something, and she wasn't ready for it. They're going to tackle my ass. <laughs> After they finished going through my bag, and I had to walk through the metal detector... The man told me right then, he said, well, now, if they sit you in the front, you can't show your phone case. Because on the back of my phone case, it says HR Howard Reese, right? Um, available on my online store. Get your life. Uh, so, yeah. I was like, oh, yeah, no problem. This is cool. I can even take it off if I have to. It's not a big deal, right? We're waiting in the audience holding area. And they got the vending machines and a little coffee and some more. And, you know, we're just socializing, chatting. When you go to the Wendy Williams show, you need to have your question ready, okay? Because they want you to write down a question as soon as you get into the um, audience holding area. I was like, oh my God, do I have to ask a question? Because my life is not in the shambles, love. Okay, I don't need any assistance from Wendy at this exact moment. I would need to go through a little something. Now, I could have went on there and threw a little shade, okay? I could have. But I didn't, because I told the girl sitting in front of me, I said, I should say what I want to say. I want to ask some questions, okay? But I'm going to drop names with the questions. She said, oh, no, don't do that. You don't drop names. I said, but I would, okay? But in the end, I said, I'll just rise above. <laughs> so now it's time. We're lining up, okay? And we're filing ourselves on in, and my heart gets the beating. I'm like, oh, my gosh, this is so exciting. Like, I really honestly love the Wendy Williams show. Like, I literally watch every day, like, without a doubt and if I don't I went and I took my cable box back to the cable people okay and went off because it didn't record one day I was very upset where you have to get on this elevator all right and then it takes you on up I'm like yes god here we are this is we are doing this so then the doors open and then we're walking on all back right and oh mind you you can't have your phone out. Okay, they're going to tell you, turn your phone off. If you have your phone out, okay, you got to get. Okay, get out with your phone. I said, oh, God, please don't let nothing ring on me because I don't want to be the one, okay? They said that the front row goes by outfit. I said, oh, I think I'm pretty cute today. I mean, this is just a little something. So I'm standing there. I'm like, okay, there's two seats sitting in the front. It's my turn. I'm like, yes, God. Okay, I can sit right here, honey. All this coat, honey. I could even take up the second seat if you need it. The woman said, one second. I said, oh, 
Okay. One second. Okay. Yes, it's, it's right there, girl. Follow him on around. Honey, I looked at her. I said, you said follow him? Yeah, on around. I said, oh, huh. Honey, they sent my ass off in the corner. Now, mind you, I really didn't care because, like, I really wasn't there to really be on TV. Like, this is, once again, not what that is. This is just Howard. Howard was going to a show he loves to get his Hot Topics in person and really find out if I could really say it like I mean it while I was there. And you can, and you should, okay? Because I screamed out a many a time. And it, Wendy kind of reacted to it. I was living for it, okay? Well, shout out to Suzanne, oh my God. Suzanne, I love you. I love you so, 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 so much. I think you are the coolest. I love your hair, I love your laugh, I love you in the kitten heels. I love it when you come on out. Like, Wendy, it's the best ever. Now, whew, and shout out to your husband because I saw him and I was like, I think that's Suzanne, hu Suzanne's husband, but I was, I wanted to speak to him, but I was like, he don't know me. Let me just let that man mind his business and I'm a mind mine. Let me just discuss this Mr. Marco Glorious, okay? Because he was the one uh, who hypes the crowd up and he and DJ Booth, shout out to DJ Booth too because the music was on point in every way. But Mr. Marco Glorious, he is hilarious, okay? He kept me very like, energetic okay he kept us awake everything was really really good and he was doing great okay i was loving it oh stand up and dance where are you from let me see you dance let me see you dance and then it's at the end of the show when you know yeah and he saw me he was like oh i didn't even see you sitting over there in the corner i was like <laughs> let me he stand up and let everyone see you and i was like oh i can do that yes here i go <laughs> and it and it was all good he was like okay let me see you dance and then he turned around and started walking away and I was like, oh God, oh God, why did you ask me to dance? I am not a dancer, okay? I don't dance. Honey, I'll stand here and let you look. I'll move a little bit so I can sparkle for you, but what do you need me to do? No, he wanted me to dance, so I'm like, ah, okay, ah, ah. and I sat down. Honey, by the time he turned back around, I was already sitting and he was like, oh, oh, uh, give it up for Howard. Mm-mm, don't call on me. Don't call on me, Mr. Marco Glorious, okay? Don't do it new but i think you're fantastic though like you're a really great person to come and keep us hype okay because you definitely did i had a great time backing on up they sat me off in the corner and i was literally sitting directly behind the hot topics guys shout out to y'all okay because i love y'all and i was all up in the prompt i was like oh what's next if you really want to know the moment there were there were a few but Two moments that really sh shined out was, I was the first, I love you, Wendy. And during Hot Topic, she talked about the Spice Girls, and she said, I got bad news for you. And right after that, it was like Tourette's, okay? Like, I, what? <laughs> and Wendy said, okay. <laughs> but no, truth on truth, I was a little bit pissed, okay? Because... See, Victoria Beckham is the reason for this season, okay? She's the reason for the turmoil. She don't want to do it, and she needs to get on this bandwagon and understand that Spice Girls was the best thing going, okay? I still watch Spice World like it came out yesterday, okay? When I get it up, okay? Come on, come on! Who remembers? It is freezing. Oh, back up. It is freezing. It is... It was cold, okay? I was... I looked up a couple times. I said, I know good and well there's an icicle up there. I know it is, because I was freezing, Freezing, okay, and the poor woman next to me, oh, her eyes just kept watering. I was like, You want a tissue? Uh, you going through. And then she was all about Ice Cube, okay? Oh, Shay! Oh, Shay! I was like, God damn it, what the hell are you saying? Oh, Shay, what? But she was really, really lovely. She was a very nice lady, and shout out to her. The show is going, and everything is great. And Wendy was coming through, and she saw my outfit. She was like, Oh, and we had a little snatch moment. And long story short, it's time for the eye candy. And I'm like, oh yes, God, I may not be in the front row, honey, but look, this is this looks like eye candy, no? Shout it out. I said, I mean, I'm a little warm right now, although it's cold as hell in here. I could use a little fan. Not so much. Cause see, she said eye candy is next. I was like, I got it. I started straightening my clothes. Honey, I said, I don't want to be crooked from a close-up. And then I, I looked across the way. I said, who the hell is that heifer over there? I know good and damn, what does she have when I know good and damn well she's not getting the eye candy. And then the people around me start to giggle. And that's fine. I love to bring a giggle and a giggle. And then bless his heart, Mem saw, okay, he saw me from across the way. He was dying, okay, dying. Okay, and God bless you, Mem saw, for coming over to console me. Because you know I was upset. I said, I know I look good as hell in this. Okay, I know I look good. Okay, you ain't got to tell me. 
But I don't know what the hell she had on. I said, that is not the eye candy. But I believe the eye candy is also about uh, being cute on a budget or something. I don't know. Because this is not budget, okay? This is a custom-made piece from beginning, middle, to end. From the coat, to the shirt, to the pants. Also, this is not a jumper. I read in the comments um, on Wendy's video, which we'll get to, that someone was like, oh, I love your jumper. And it's not. It's like a shirt and pants. But shirt and jeans. But it's cool. I just appreciate that you liked it. So that kind of bummed me out. I was like, oh no, not my eye candy. But then the big, the best moment ever happened because then Wendy was like, come here. And it, uh, child, I hopped up. Cause at first I was like, is she talking to me? Oh my God. Hey Wendy. I hopped up and she told me to come here. The poor woman next to me, I knocked her over. Okay, I sure didn't. I was, I know I stepped on some feet. I'm sorry, but there was no time. It's a live show. When she calls you over, you got to get, okay? Cause I'm like, well, she wants to have some type of word exchange, some verbiage, okay? So here I am, there's only but so much time on a commercial break. I want all of my words to fit, okay? And then out of nowhere, she was like, she wanted me to be with her for the end of the show. I was like, oh my God, Wendy. Shout out to that. Check me out on Instagram. Check me out on her um, on her video on the show. There's a there, it's on my um my YouTube channel too in the Howard Moments playlist. Get your life on that. But it's also the clip is also on my um Instagram. Okay, at HRS Experience. Okay, there's a link in the description to all my social media. Okay, so but that was like the most epic moment ever, and I had to throw in my little hi dry. I, oh God, I said, how you doing to Wendy so many times? I, I, because I was like, oh my gosh, like, I'm really standing here talking to Wendy. I had, I had to say it a couple. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? I know I give the best damn how you doing since a six week sneak peek. Okay. How you doing? Oh yes, I go in. And I'm going to tell you, I got to see her rings up close, like in my face. And I was all up in her face. We was close. I was like, oh my God, Wendy is so pretty. Like she is put together. Wow! Now, I mean, yes, and also, I'm gonna just speak my inner truth. I don't think her boobs are that, they're big now. They are healthy. But they're not like, she's gonna tip over, okay? No, I mean, it didn't seem that as outrageous as it does on the TV. The TV does do something tricky, okay? So the show is over and oh shout out to Ice Cube. I thought you were super duper amazing and I saw Ride Along 2 and I love the movie. Okay, let me know when you're doing Ride Along 3 because I would love to be in it. Let's just speak the truth. And shout out to Kevin Hart, okay, because he is hilarious. Oh God, just watch that movie and tell me if you saw it in the comment section. Did you think it was hilarious? Did you like it as much as the first one? I did. I thought it was great. And shout out to Tika Scepter because I love her too. Anyway, backing on up, backing on up. Time for the after show. And who even knew that I was going to be a part of that? Because I had no idea. Wendy goes off into the back, and the next thing, her and Tristan are out. And she's like, hey, sir, 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 come here, come here, come here. And I'm like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wendy wants me again? We're going to walk into the sunset together? No. When I got down there, she just said, all I want you to do is twirl. And I was living for it. I was like, you want me to twirl? Oh, I'll twirl for you. Now, mind you, can we jump on back? I was planning on winning eye candy long before I actually made it to New York to the show, okay? I was like, oh, I'm going to stand up, yes! And then I was going to step into the aisle and I was going to twirl around and I was going to walk to Wendy to receive my fan, right? Well, since that didn't happen, but it was super duper amazing that I got to twirl around for Wendy, okay? On the after show, make sure you check that out. I believe the episode is called uh, Cold as Ice or... Something like that. It has something to do with ice. Yeah. And that is what's in the Howard moments. Check it out. Because you're going to live for it. Okay? You are going to live for it. See that twirl. And also check it out on my Instagram. Okay? Because I'm telling you, it's everything you need. So I had a grand old time. Shout out to every staff member at Wendy. I think you guys are like the best staff ever. Because y'all were super duper friendly. Um, super duper professional. Okay? It wasn't no ratchet foolery going on. I mean, Wendy is quick to say this messy show. But the show in itself is not a mess. They were doing a beautiful job. I lived for it. Okay? Because I want to go back. Okay? Wendy, you need to let me be money like a correspondent. Or something. Let me go to the Grammys or something. And, you know, interview people on the carpet or something. I don't know. <sighs> as I was standing outside waiting for my Uber, okay? Cause as you know, honey, I don't take the New York taxis no more. That time I almost died and thoroughly 
Got scared for my life leaving the Dawn Rashad concert. Mm-mm. I'll take a Uber and say, go slow and see the town because you go fast, I'm on last. Shout out to Granny. As I was standing out there, I had a quick little catch up with um, Antoine Jackson, okay, Wendy's hairstylist. Uh, he's super duper friendly. Okay, he was just going on a stroll and I was like, what? Oh my God, hey, can we, and I asked him so we could take a picture and he was like, yeah. Super duper friendly, okay, and I told him that he is amazing. Okay, because he all, I love her glam squad just because one, they're friendly people. Two, they are uh, uh, super duper talented. Okay, they always have Wendy like on a thousand and I love that. But yeah, that was my Wendy little beautiful moment. I loved it and Wendy, thank you so much for all of the moments that you gave me. Like, honestly, I can't thank you enough because you just are hilarious. The show is so funny and I can't wait to continue to watch. Congratulations on being renewed, okay? Cause I am ready. DVR is set. Okay, I get it and I catch it back again on the BET at midnight. Yes, I do. Okay, yes, I do. Thank you so much for watching this video and listening to my whole little Wendy Williams moment. And how cool was that, right? And there are so many other great things happening this year already that I can't talk about yet, but you will see them soon, like next month or maybe the month after, maybe every month, okay? Who knows? Maybe every other day. Listen, or maybe every day during the week. You don't know what's coming, okay? I know, but you're just going to have to wait to find out, okay? Make sure you check me out on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook and all of my social media. There are links in the description. Also, please download my song on iTunes, Amazon, Google Play, wherever you buy music, it's there. Okay? Download my song. My name is Howard Reese and my song is called I Need My Music. Don't forget to hit my subscribe button. Okay, thumbs up this video if you liked it and please leave a comment letting me know what you think about everything in this video. Okay? And thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye! Oh my God, if that wasn't the most amazing thing ever. Here we go, walking through Wendy. The double doors, there goes the double doors right there. We're so behind the scenes.